Ladies and gentlemen, this one is super exciting. William Street, Shell Harbour Village. If you're looking to get into Shell Harbour Village, you've got very limited options at the moment. You have had limited options for the past couple of years. Now, to get into a quiet street in Shell Harbour Village is even harder. We've got a nice dual occupancy here that we're bringing to market. It's only built two years ago. It's footsteps to the multi-billion dollar investment in Shell Cove Marina. Footsteps back up to Shell Harbour Village. You've got the best of both worlds. So we're gonna show you through the positives about it, what it offers, and then if you wanna come have a look, give us a yell on our mobile and we'll book in a private appointment for you. You've got nice recycled brick on the outside. You've got a James Hardy clad. Uh, it was built by Unique Builders, which is a local company that focus on a lot of high-end construction. Um, they've done this dual occupancy for a friend of theirs, our clients, amazing people. Come on through and I'll show you the details. So as you, as you first step inside, you got your internal access for your garage just here. Now, the good thing about this spot is you've got a ample off-street parking plus parking on your driveway. So a lot of people would probably choose to use this as a gym because this, this street is dead quiet. The, you, you can park out there, your kids can play cricket out there. It's one of the only opportunities in Shell Harbour Village where you can do this. So the owners have got to set it up as a gym, but you can definitely park a car in there plus storage. Okay, we'll duck upstairs shortly. Now, downstairs you've got a laundry and a powder room. Okay, servicing for when you've got guests over, say as I'm having to duck upstairs, you've got powder room and laundry with external access to get down to the backyard. And one thing I find when I'm selling homes is the mums, they always want to be able to see their kids playing in the backyard from the kitchen. So the, the floor plan of this home really is super functional and super practical in terms of if you've got young kids or even if you're just a retiree and you want to be able to see your backyard and have that natural light flowing through. So you've got kitchen here, ample storage to our left here, dining, lounge room, outdoor alfresco, and then low maintenance backyard. So you've got a nice greeny backyard, but it is low maintenance. You've got fake turf there, so don't have to bring the lawnmower out. And as we come through, there's plenty of windows on this left-hand side of the property allowing natural light. You've got higher than standard um, ceilings internally, so it really has a nice feel to it. Uh, and then you've got a massive lounge room up to the rear here. You've got ducted air con throughout, split into multiple zones, keeping you hot or cold throughout the year. Your flooring is an engineered floorboard, um, wider than usual, giving it a much more luxury feel. It's, it's a beautiful looking product and it wears really well. If you do have kids, you're not gonna, it's hard to damage it. So something that will age really well. Stepping outside, beautiful big alfresco. Now you've got all your preliminary services in for a gas barbecue built in um, section to go on this wall, but look at all that natural light. Drenches this backyard, um, exposed aggregate pathways right up the side for the kids to get their bikes up and down if you want, but the, how good is this? You don't have to get the lawnmower out. Nice and green backyard, all fake turf. So something that is really rare in terms of nice duplexes or townhouses, they don't have a backyard. So it's great that this offers it. We'll, um, we'll duck upstairs and check out the rest. Now upstairs, you've got a couple choices in terms of how you can use the home. Okay, you've got two kids bedrooms here, which are serviced by the main bathroom off to our left here, which I'll show you in just a sec. Both having built-in wardrobes, okay, both getting plenty of natural light from that side. The home on the left of this property is absolutely amazing. So the chance of that being knocked down and redeveloped is next to nothing. So. The sun is always gonna be coming through this side, which is great. You've also got skylights throughout the property, so it's always naturally lit up. It feels really nice. Um, as you step to the back of the property, little study desk. These have become super popular post COVID. Everyone needs to work from home. So having that there is very practical and allows you to do what you need. Now, this is the cool part about this house. It could be a four better, okay? We're advertising it as a four better. The floor plan is of a four better, but the owners have just ch chosen to take this door out, leaving it as a lounge room up the back here. So you've got your main living area downstairs, plus another large living area upstairs, or it could be a fourth bedroom, depending on what you're wanting to use it for. 
So yeah, this is actually your bathroom for the services, the, the kids' bedrooms. It's huge freestanding bath. Um, it's got an amazing Torato tile throughout, all, all white tiles internally, so have a look at that. And your main bedroom. Okay, so main bedroom with a nice deck out here. You've got your walk-in robe, plenty of storage, and then you've got your ensuite in there. So when you step out here onto the balcony, super private feel. So you've got these very established trees out the front, still low maintenance, but they look amazing. And then you are still footsteps to the beach. So you can see the new Shelco precinct just there. Um, the thing is when you step into that Shelco precinct, it becomes busy. In this street, it's dead quiet. There's, there's no one ever coming down this street. We can stand here for the next two hours and not a single car will drive by. So it is rare if you've got young kids, the ability for them to play out here and, and play with the other kids in the street. It's something that we don't see too often these days. Um, but yeah, the, the privacy as well being up here with the trees in front is amazing. So this home is on the market. Okay, it is for sale. The owners are wanting to sell the property. It is a unique opportunity, not too much like this pops up in Shell Harbour Village or really in, in most of our suburbs in terms of this quality for around this price. So if you're wanting further information, give me a call, Cooper from Ray White. My mobile and my details will be below and we look forward to seeing you soon.